Hey everybody! <laughs> um, way long time no see. Um, it's been, tomorrow will be two months since I made a video, which I know is an insanely, um, if you see me jump real quick, it's because there's wasps in, in my yard and I have a thing about getting stung by them. I don't like the little assholes at all. <laughs> so if you see me jump around a lot, that's why. But, um, I was already outside and I was like, oh my god, it, it kind of dawned on me how long it had been since I made a video, and, um, it's just been really crazy, and that's not normal for me on any level. I usually don't have that much going on at one time, which is, makes me sound kind of sad, <laughs> and I don't mean it to be, but, um, uh, I had initially planned to only take like a week off. I was going to be on vacation and I was just like, okay, nope, I'm taking a week off. And then it, it just kind of, stuff kind of snowballed out of nowhere. Um, I got involved with a project at work that's involving a lot of overtime that came out of nowhere, thank goodness, because I'm loving the pay, but it's taken up quite a bit of time after I get home, after five o'clock, I work on it at night after so it's taking up quite a bit of my time uh mosquito um so there's been a lot of that um loving the pay though loving the pay and the project is coming to conclusion i believe pretty soon like within the next couple of weeks i think so um i'm gonna miss the money <laughs> not gonna like, miss that little bit extra money um I've been also doing a lot out in my yard, not right there specifically, like right over my shoulder, that's not, there's like, you can't see and, um, I'll have to show you guys, but it's not quite done, there's a couple little things that I'm still working on, but you know, I've been really good this year, I put the plants in the ground like right after I buy them so they don't die, I've only had that happen to two, <laughs> um, and I never did get to plant my sunflower seeds because the area that I was going to put them in still hasn't been cleared out. Um, that one, it's a, that, the area that I was going to put the sunflowers in, which gets a lot of light, which would be great for the sunflowers, it needs to seriously be cleaned up and it's not, it's not ready for planting. So that sucks. But I got, um, I got my lavender done, and see, I'm, I'm looking right here at the lavender, the marjoram, the spearmint, the peppermint, the chocolate mint, um, I got some cilantro, I got some bee balm there, and then behind me, like right here, you can see the hibiscus that I planted a couple of years ago, and then in front of them is a bunch of marigolds, and some basil, and then over here, I can't, like where my elbow is. <laughs> um, Mm, excuse me, there's rosemary, lavender, lemon thyme, and some uh, sage. All in a circle, and I'll show I'll show you. I, that one's like this close to being done. There's just a couple more things I want to tweak with it, and then I can show you guys. Like I said, I'm really proud of that. That one, I think I designed it pretty awesome. And there is a wasp. And go away, shoo, away with thee. And then I also kind of started a fairy garden kind of deal, which was rather disappointing because I thought it was going to be done last weekend and then I went I had made doors and windows and they won't stick to the tree <laughs> so I had to scrap what I had already done and the thing was is I already sculpted it and painted it and everything come out here and then they wouldn't adhere to the tree so I'm going to have to screw them into the tree which I really don't want to do so I'm trying to find out if there's another way around that because I really don't want to screw something into the tree I don't want to do that so, um, but I made swings, there's like little swings, um, which was really easy. Um, those are hanging from the tree already, and then there's like ribbons galore because of Beltane. I've got tons of ribbons hanging from my trees. That's, that's how I was festive with Beltane, which is something I hardly ever do either. Hardly ever. Beltane and I just kind of, eh, one year I'll do it, and the next year I'm like, eh, no. So it's a very iffy one with me, um, but... This year, I took and just, there's like ribbons hanging from a whole bunch of trees. I think you can see some hanging from the tree right there. And then maybe some from up here. 
that's only got one of there because that's really high branches and it's hard and it's on a slope so it's hard for me to reach and with my ankle it just it doesn't work very well but like over this way where you of course you can't see <laughs> um just tons of ribbons tons of ribbons um that way um and of course it had to be the branches that i could reach so it's all the bottom branches <laughs> are the only ones i could reach but i hit a pine tree up i got the, um, a couple of oak trees over there and then the, the, this isn't really a tree i'm pretty sure that's a ficus but that was already there when I moved in. So. Oh, that, now yeah, I finally got my air conditioning fixed. Because, <sighs> let me tell you, it was hot. And I couldn't take it anymore. <laughs> it's like, no, I gotta, I gotta, it's gotta get fixed. So, but yeah, I took a bunch of the fencing down in the yard. And I'll have to do a video and show you guys after everything's done. The front yard looks really good. Um, so I have to do, like I said, I'll have to do a video and show you guys, like, there because that the front is doing really awesome um the backyard was in serious need of tlc i had been having problems with the black black backyard <gasps> i spent time with my relatives today so can you tell because the last name's black that's why just we have a joke and it's it if you take too long to explain just never mind um what else has been going on? Um, had a couple deaths in the family. One was expected. One was very unexpected. Well, as far as I knew, it was unexpected. It was uh, a relative of North Carolina. And my uncle had passed away. Um, and he had cancer and I didn't know it. And then my uh, stepfather's uh, grandmother passed away. She made it to 99 and a half. Um, but we, we didn't been expecting that one. I mean, when you get to be around 99, people are kind of expecting, yeah. And she'd been in a home for a couple years, and you could see her just, you know, over the years, she was deteriorating. Um, uh, let's see, what else? Um, so much in two months, and I cannot think of anything to tell you guys. I know I've been rambola like crazy, I know that. Um, see, I cannot think of anything now. Oh my god. Um, oh, happy Mother's Day to everybody. Um, my kids were really good to me this year, and um, they got me they got me some stuff and like these earrings. I got hoop earrings. I haven't had hoop earrings in a while, and then they got me some other stuff. And then they put the thing. I posted a Facebook picture of it because I was really really excited about it. This um, earthenware uh, seahorse chime, and it's really loud for the neighbors. <laughs> I love that they knew I'd love that. Um, so the wind can blow all day long and I'll be at work and won't bother me. Um, but yeah, it's, it's on the front porch and it's like this aqua color. It's really, it's really, really nice. Um, just a bunch of other stuff. I've been, been really, been, like I said, I've been busier than I'm used to being. Um, so it, it's kind of messed with me a little bit. I, uh, I did take a day and I like all my wind chimes that had fallen, like uh, had fallen down because the string broke or something had happened and they needed to be repaired. I had like five sets of wind chimes to repair. That took like a day. Um, but I got all of them back up except for one. Um, I've got a bamboo one that I can't just, it, it's, 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 one of the things is split down the side and I've been trying to figure out whether or not it's worth fixing and I kind of put it down because I just can't I got so much other stuff going on right now I can't really spend a whole lot of time on it so that one's been shoved off to the side but yeah all my other wind chimes are back up um, I've got a couple of sun catchers that I made um, out of the, the, the pony beads the plastic pony beads I had them sitting in my craft stuff because uh, when I was on vacation, I went through my craft stash, all my craft stuff. I got a whole bunch of yarn that I had bought. I couldn't remember why I bought it, so that went into a bag, and I took it to my grandmother because my grandmother makes um, sweaters for um, children but I don't remember where they she sent it to some charity or and they go somewhere I don't know she makes sweaters and hats like all the time 
So she got really excited when I gave her, I gave her like a whole bag of yarn. And some of them were brand new skeins, never been touched. I mean, they still have a little wrapper thing around them and everything. I had never touched them. Um, a couple of them I had used like a little bit for something and then I was done with it and I had no use for like right like this color orange I didn't have a use for it anymore so I just kind of went there you go and she, I know she'll use it and she will um, I'm just I'm, I'm very rambly right now I know um, I'm I'm super behind on YouTube, YouTube Pagan Challenge. I know. I'm aware. Um, I don't know. I haven't decided whether or not I'm just going to skip them and just pick up from now or I'm going to go back and do and catch up. Um, and then same with the Grimoire Challenge. Um, I'm a little bit behind on actually doing the stuff for it. I'm, I've got a couple that I'm behind on. I haven't done. Um, and then, but for the most part, I've, I've got all the assignments done, or the prompts, I should call them, I should call them prompts. Uh, got most of the prompts done, I just haven't sat down and recorded it, and that then there comes the, well, am I going to do it all in the video, or am I going to break it up, and I'll probably, if I do, do catch up, okay, uh, do catch up, then uh, it, it, I'll probably break it up into a small, couple of smaller videos. Um, I think that's it. I mean, I, I have missed making videos. I have. It's just crap me crazy right now. And I mean, and that's just not stuff going on. That's just stuff with me. That's not including stuff going on with the kids right now. And it's gearing down for a year. Um, my middle one's got exams and stuff. Um, he's got a big one that, coming up in a couple days. The youngest one, it's his, it's his last year in elementary school, so there's all this. He, he even got, a, really proud of him, though, because he even got a reward the other day. He's really turned himself around the past couple of days, so, or a couple of days, past couple of months, school-wise, so very proud of him for that. So, I mean, it's just been a lot. Oh, my mom. Oh, my God. How can I forget? My mom. My mom is doing so much better. Um, she's been going to therapy. Um. She can close her hand now. It, t it takes her a, a, a little bit, but she can close her hand, and her thumb started moving this week. Just started moving this week, her thumb just started. So the therapy is working. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, because you know, she's been really stressed about it, really worried about it. Um, her uh, her bosses have been really, have really been working with her, though. Um, they said once she gets to where she, she can drive again, um, she could come back to, you know, and get signed off where she can come back to work. Um, cause she, obviously she's not going to be able to type like she used to. They said they will find something for her to do. So, that's a huge relief for her because right now she's, she's anxious to get back to work. She's worried about not working. So, yeah, I think that's it. 13 and a half minutes of me just doing rambly bits. It's another video for me. Yay. Um, so I will hopefully see you guys again sometime too. Okay. Um, again, happy Mother's Day, everybody, and I'll see you again next time. Bye.